So recently I went to Montreal and the first night there, uh, the per like I stayed with my friend and her roommate was like, oh yeah, so I'm sure you've heard that Ellen and Portia are getting a divorce. And I was like, oh, what? I thought like the world was ending. Like I just, I didn't know what to believe because I was looking at like tabloid stuff. What? Why would I even look at tabloid stuff? Anyway, so I freaked myself out for nothing because obviously they're not getting a divorce. And then so, but like I, I kind of thought it was weird that Ellen hadn't addressed the rumors before. Anyway, so today she finally answered my question and she did a monologue about it, so I'm happy to announce that Ellen says that they're not getting a divorce. They are A-OK -okay and in love, which makes me really, really happy. When I when I thought they weren't happy, I was like, oh my god, how am I ever going to be happy? Like, <laughs> I just, I was being really dramatic. Anyway, so I'm happy that they're happy. My favorite part of the monologue is when Ellen says that the thing that they fight about most is who loves each other more. And it just, ah, oh, they just warm my heart. I just want to love like theirs. And here's her monologue to show it. Keep on smiling and dancing. Bye. I think I know why you're excited. <laughs> It's hump day and 12 days at the same time. All right, just settle down, sit tight. That's happening later in the show. So uh, here's the thing. You know, I usually don't pay attention to tabloids and gossip magazines unless I'm standing in line at the grocery store. And then I devour them like chocolate pudding. And I'm kidding. I don't go to a grocery store. Um, so. The other day, um, I'm at the hair salon and uh, getting these extensions put in. And there's uh, tabloids all over the hair salons. That's where they are, I guess. So, so I, I don't really look at them ever. I really don't. And um, I all of a sudden notice one sitting on the counter in front of me. I don't want to say which one it was. Uh, but the cover, it says number one for celebrity news. And obviously, they would not lie about that. <laughs> So uh, it caught my eye because Portia and I were in the top right-hand corner, and I thought, oh, that's sweet. They're honoring us. And uh, <laughs> then I read the headline underneath, and it said, uh, Ellen and Portia, marriage crumbles. And I was like, oh, what happened? They seem so happy. And, <laughs> that, and then I was like, oh, wait, I'm Ellen, and then I should know if that's happening. And so um, I debated on whether I wanted to open it or not. I don't like letting that energy in, so I don't, I, I, and then I was like, ah, I just want to see it. So I, I get the magazine, and I'm flipping through, I'm, and there's one page torn out. The only page torn out was my story. I will never know what is tearing my marriage apart. I don't know what's happening. Oh my God, it's so ridiculous to me. There's not one ounce of truth to any of it. I am very happily married. In fact, the only thing we ever argue about is who loves who more. That is all, I, it really is true. It's, and one other, we, we argue if we would let a kangaroo carry us in, in a pouch for a year. And I would, she wouldn't, but. She, She'll change her mind. She'll come around. Who wouldn't want to be in a pouch of a kangaroo for a year, just popping around like that? And she's like, no. But anyway. Um, and I know they have to fill magazines. Every issue, every week, it has to be filled up. But I don't know how they can print lies like that. And, and it's tricky because they quote a reliable source or a good friend. Because you know how many good friends would talk to tabloids, right? All your good friends would. Really, if they want to make it more believable, they should at least say, Portia and Ellen's marriage crumbles according to a terrible, terrible friend. <laughs> I don't know how many stories are out there about me. I don't Google myself. I don't pay attention to paparazzi pictures. I don't want to know. It's like if a tree falls in the forest and no one is around to hear it, who cares who wore it better? You know? <laughs> I don't care. I, what I do know is I come out here every day. I tell you what's going on in my life. And if there's anything you need to know, I will announce it here first. And this is what you need to know right now. It is time for us to dance.